Hello. I'm trying to make another video here. I'm kind of in between two storm cells here, so I'm going to do the best I can here. This might be a quick one. Well, 74 Chevrolet conversion. Well, I've been having some transmission problems. I was having troubles uh, with the um, flex plate on the back of the engine uh, mounting up to the TH350 torque converter. Well, I found the remedy. Comes to find out it was a 400 flex plate. The TH400 Chevy Trans. I got a hold of a um, 700R4 flex plate for the diesel and it looks like we're in pretty good shape. Uh, that's all I've been fighting with the last couple of days. Um, after a long disassembly and reassembly, the transmission's back in. I had it out and uh, I was trying to change it over and convert it. And I ran into some problems, as usual. As you well know is how these conversions go. If you happen to be a mechanic or work on this stuff all the time, I'm sure you've seen things like this before. This is a 700 transmission I picked up. Okay. With the transfer case. I've, I've already separated them. Okay. Um, well, the story is this tail shaft is too long to go on the back of the uh, 205 transfer case. So, at a later time, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and do the conversion. But for right now, later on. Later. Okay. I've got the engine out, as you probably already know. Get motors out, cabs off, the motors lay on the ground. That's what it is. That's what used to be in it. I'm going to miss it. But right, what are you going to do? It's available. If anybody wants to buy it, I've got uh, I've got a number kicking around my head. If you can come close to it. I think I can facilitate something if you want it. It's a 350 Chevrolet. If you have any questions about it, ask. I'll do the best I can to answer them. Um, so anyway, uh, I just have a handful of things left to do, small things, and I'll be ready to put the engine in. I've been using the back of the truck as a workbench. <laughs> uh, so there we have it. Motor mounts. I'm going to put new motor mounts in. These guys. I painted them so they look good. Not, not that you can see them, but they look good. So that's about the story. That's all I've been doing here lately. I haven't done a whole lot. Been missing on some videos and things like that a few steps but I get started I just get going and that's it so okay that's the video for now it's the update uh, so I guess I'll see you later pointer there we are. see ya